Uh, really? Hi. Okay, talk to you guys again soon. Oh, jeez. Okay, whatever. Okay. Okay, now, where was I? Okay. Uh, um, three. What's going on here? Three. What in the world? Three, two, one. I'm going to play a game of solitaire for American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. Playing solitaire is a great way to practice decision making in a four player game, but of course you're by yourself. So you need to pretend like you don't know what's in each of the player's hands. If you can do that, there's always something to learn. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. All my tiles are mixed. They're built into walls next to the racks. This way, we can keep track of the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left for picking. I'm going to deal the tiles now. East will get 14. South, West, and North will get 13 each. Then. We'll look at everybody's hand and pick a waypoint. Everybody has their tiles. Let's see what we can do for East. Okay, we have no multiples. Look at all these cracks. Three dots, three bams. I do see one, three, three, five, three, five, three, four, five, six, or one, three, five. Let's focus on one, three, five, little odds or three, four, five, six. And there are hands that we might be able to use a dragon for, so let's keep that. And we can see now what we can do for south. Pair twos, that's gonna be the strength of the hand right there. One, two, three, four. consecutive run or like numbers with twos let's see what we can do for west I think we should play like numbers with dragons like numbers with dragons and sixes let's pass those three Pair of fives, pair of fours, two, three, four, five, consecutive run. We do have a pair of Norse that I don't think we're going to be able to use. Three, four, five, six, or two, three, four, five. We'll see, but I want to leverage these four, five, and those are consecutive. So let's play consecutive. Either that or like numbers with fours, and we'll use that as joker bait. So let's pass those. We're going to pass now. East passes to south. South to west. West to north. And north down to east. We got a one. One, three, three, five. We have tiles we can pass, so we really don't have to pick a hand yet. Three, 
one, two, three, four. I was thinking maybe we could do a year hand, but I would want to leverage the twos here. Two, four, two, like numbers with twos. Let's give up this four and keep the wins. Because if we get the right tiles, like an eight dot or a white dragon, maybe we could play news with the year. Although we'd have to throw away a pair. Let's keep the four and give up the wind because I want to use this. Sixes, didn't get any. Okay, here we got a pair of nines. Joker bait. Let's hold it and pass those. Now we're going to go across east and west, south and north. No keepers. Okay, we got a one. One, two, three, consecutive run. Let's give up the four now. One, two, three, or like numbers with twos and joker bait. Oh, look at that. We got a seven. Let's go ahead and pass those three and keep that as joker bait. No keepers. We're moving on to first left. So I'm just thinking two, three, four, five. If we get all keepers, I do not want to pass a pair. So I think, I think we should break up the pair so we could pass defensively or better than passing a pair anyway. So east is going to pass to north for first left, north to west, west to south, and then south to east. We got a four, one, three, four, three, four, five, three, four, five, six, north, seven. Let's give up the six and focus on one, three, five, little odds, or three, four, five. There's a one, one, two, one, two, one, two, three. Oh, we keep getting that north. One, two, one, two, pair of ones. One, two, three, one, two, three. Consecutive run, mixed suit Kongs. This is the fifth hand down on the right under consecutive run. Let's keep Let's keep the ones for potential like numbers with ones and pass those. We want sixes. We got sevens though. We're kind of in between. Hmm. Let's go with lucky seven. Break up the pair. Lucky seven. Okay, we got nine pair of nines. Five, eight, nine. South seven. Let's see. Four, five. Yeah, that's not helpful. Let's stick with it. So we did first left. Now we're going to do second left, east to north, north to west, west to south, south to east. Ooh, two. 
Okay, one, three, four, three, four, five, two, three, four, five. We have to pick a hand now. I'd rather not pass the white dragon. Let's see here. One, three, five maybe would be the strongest. Look at all the options. One, three, five. Maybe we could do something with odds. Let's just hold all the odds. Let's pass those. We're looking for like numbers with ones or one, two, three. We can pass those. Oh, we got a seven. That's nice. Let's pass those three. Like numbers with sevens. Okay, we've got a six. Three, four, five, six. We can pass those three. That was second left. Now we're going to do a cross. East and west, north and south. We're looking for odds now. Let's just keep all the odds. We can pass those. Like numbers with ones or consecutive run. Sevens didn't get any. Maybe this will be a little better than the four. Three, four, five, six, two, three, four, five, three, four, five, six. Let's keep that and pass that. It's a little risky with the eight, nine, and one suit, but we need some help here. And we could maybe do four, five, six knitted with the red dragon. East passes to south, south to west, west to north, north to east. We got a nine. One, three, five, five, seven, nine. Optional cross. So we have odds. Don't have to pick a hand till you run out of discards. No keepers here. Oh, we got a keeper, a seven. Okay, like numbers with sevens and we have tiles to pass. Oh, we picked up that six. And we have tiles there to pass. Four, five, six, three, four, five, six, joker bait. Three, four, five, six, three, four, five, six. Let's get a full pass and pass the two. So we're going to do optional cross. East and west, north and south. Nine, we got a nine. Okay, we gotta try to use that. We've got discards, I think. Five, nine. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, we got a two. Let's just put these in order. One, two, three, pair of norths. Let's just hold those and discard the four. No keepers here. Picked up a four. 
three, four, four, five. We can discard those and see what happens. Four, five, three, four, five, six. We'll see. We're done with the Charleston. Now we're going to start with picking and discarding. We're going to start by discarding this north for east. I'm going to use this to track whose turn it is. Nobody can take the north. That's probably not going to be good joker bait. East. Okay, let's just get rid of the winds. East. Keeper. West. Joker bait. South. Green. We'll keep it for a little while. Let's discard the four bam. West. Eight bam. Doesn't matter. Let's discard the four dot. I probably could get rid of the eights though because those are in the biggest hand on the card under singles and pairs. If you're not going to use them, I would discard them. So we'll get rid of those next. Oh, flower might come in handy. Let's see. We don't have to pick yet. Sixes. Let's keep the six. We've got all the sixes. Let's discard this two crack. Nobody wants it anyway. They might, but they, they're not ready for it. Flower, that might come in handy. Let's discard maybe the dragons, but let's just look really quick at the odds because we have odds and dragons. So maybe really we could start with this one and nine. There's one hand that uses both ones and nines in different suits. Second from the bottom, one, three, five, seven, nine. We don't have the seven bam. So that, that's a big, big gap. The other thing we might be able to do is play three, six, nine. So let's three, six, nine. Use this as joker bait maybe. Um, one, three, three, five, one, three, three, five. We don't need all these three fives and I want to leverage these. I think we should play three, six, nine, even though there's a gap. Let's discard this five, bam. Flower. Okay. They have all these flowers. Let's keep going north. Not a lot they can do. There's no need to make a decision yet. We've got discards. We're going to draw five bam. Let's go ahead and discard the eights. Six. Okay. Three, four, six, four, five, six, six. Let's get rid of this two crack. There's a six, three, six, nine. Let's get rid of the five. This is going to be joker bait. Three, six, nine. We might be able to use these. Now up here, I would not commit to that. We could play four, five, six knitted. But we have no red dragon. No red dragon, no jokers. 
I would not commit to that. Let's draw Joker. Let's get rid of that North. Nine Bam. Let's get rid of this eight crack. Three crack. Okay, let's see now. Three, four, five, three, four, six, three, six, three, six. I don't think that we can use really the six here or maybe the three. We can use four, five, six, seven, three, four, five, six, seven. We have a big gap though, but I think I'd like to keep the sixes as an option for like numbers. Let's get rid of this three. I think there's too big of a spread right now. They're not ready for that three. And here, I would not commit to that. They're not ready to Kong it anyway for the mixed suit Kong hand. One bam, that's a discard. Here, we can maybe take it, but we would use the only joker and we have no other multiples with the ones. I would not call that. Eight bam. West. One crack. Not ready. Four dot. That's a discard. Nine dot. Five bam. That could be good joker bait maybe. Okay, like numbers with sevens. Let's see how close we are. Pair, pair, pung, pung, kong, maybe. Or we could do it here and use this in here. Joker bait. Let's draw. Seven crack. Okay, let's just see here. Four, five, six, seven. Six, let's see here, five, six, seven, consecutive run. Let's discard this uh, three crack because we can use these fours maybe as joker bait. We just got through the second wall. We're now heading into the third wall, which is the middle game. Everybody should know what category they're playing. Here we're playing three, six, nine, consecutive run or like numbers like numbers with sevens, probably consecutive run, four, five, six, seven. Drawing for east. That's a keeper, maybe three dot. Let's go ahead and discard the one dot. Nobody can take it, so we're gonna draw. Joker, that's really needed badly. One, two, three, or like numbers with ones. This could be Joker bait. Let's discard this four dot. They don't have to make a choice just yet. They might even be able to play a year hand. We'll see. Let's draw. Six crack. Keeping the joker bait there. Now up here, they're not ready for it. They have one six crack. There's an eight crack. Four, five, six, seven, eight. That run is not helpful. Let's get rid of the eight crack. And draw. Okay, flower. What about the 369 pair hand? 
This would be the third hand down, 369 in pairs and two suits. 369, three or three. We don't need this one either way. Let's draw. Two bam, one, two, one, two, consecutive run uh, pung hand. That's the last one under consecutive run. Or one, two, three. Let's go ahead and discard the one crack. All the ones are going down. So like numbers with ones is not so likely. And I think maybe the two crack could go next. I think one, two, one, two pungs would be good here. Let's draw green. Okay, that, that could be helpful maybe. It gives us options. Let's go ahead and discard the five bam now. And nobody wants it. Two bam. So now we have some evens coming in here. Two, four, six, four, six. Let's discard this seven crack. This is concealed. Three bam, three, six, nine, and threes. Three, six, nine with Kongs of threes. That's the third hand down. We could use these as joker bait. Three, six, nine, Kongs of threes. Let's go ahead and discard the white dragon. And this is concealed here. One crack. Oh, that's a shame. It happens sometimes. We're going to draw four west. Nine dot. No. Let's get rid of that five bam though. Nobody wants it. And we can draw up here. Four crack. Okay, now we got to decide. Two, four, six, four, five. Four, five. Let's see. Four. Four, five, six, seven. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Major gaps though. Two, four. I don't think the two's gonna help. We have a big gap with no eight and they're out. At least two are out. Let's draw. This is concealed. Four bam, we don't need that. We're going to draw here. Here, you might think, well, why not take that for a pung? We have no idea what they're playing. They're kind of stuck. We're going to draw. That's helpful. Let's get rid of this two crack. So maybe one, two, one, two. I think one, two, one, two pung concealed hand. Either way, we don't need this. We could still play one, two, three in mixed suits. And we would discard these. So let's see what happens. Nobody can take the two, so we're gonna draw uh, one bam. And this is concealed, so we could maybe call it for a Kong. Let's just think about it for a second here. Pair. Kong, Kong. We just need a three crack and a joker. There's a three crack out though. I think I would stay concealed and play, play the concealed pung hand because there's already a three crack out. Let's draw. Eight dot. We have no two, plus we have these pungs. It'd be nice to have a five dot. We could play four, five, six, or four, five, six, seven, bam. Let's discard this eight dot. They're kind of in a pickle. Six, bam. Three, six, nine, pair hand. Pair, three, six, nine, three, six, nine. Let's get rid of this green dragon. Okay, eight dot. Let's throw the three crack. I'm just thinking maybe 
they could play a year hand two zero one eight four flowers we'll see seven let's get rid of that nine dot they're one away from ready we just need a deciding tile let's draw two dot wrong suit to help they have no eights we just need to stick with it two dot if nothing else they can play defense seven dot this is concealed drawing six crack can't take it south drawing for north eight dot no twos and they already threw that that's been out now okay we're gonna draw for east five crack drawing four south east drawing four west five bam drawing for north nine bam not helpful this would be a pair hand here we can't call that there's two nine bams out now oh nine dot okay we need to decide what to do here flower three six nine three six nine I think we should stick with it because we could still do three six nine with Kongs of threes there are two three cracks out right now so it's a little risky the other option would be to play like numbers with threes let's discard the nine dot east oh there's a deciding tile so now we have pairs and there's pungs we can get rid of this green dragon and they're ready to win on either a red or a seven bam red or seven nine dot red let's discard red I think I would can keep playing the three six nine pair hand and that would be mahjong up here like numbers with sevens and let's see that's in one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fourteen discards that took a while but it's a concealed hand so this player was trying for pairs they were three away from ready on a pair hand and they had some flexibility with threes this player was in between a year hand but they have a gap with no white dragon or one two pung concealed hand two away from ready this is our winner and up here consecutive run that just didn't come together We got to the end of the middle game so that was relatively good timing for West they paired up at the right time and made the right decisions with discards going with sevens for North defense was the best choice they just could not get consecutive numbers and the twos and eights came in at the wrong time 
singles, stragglers. It's kind of hard to make decisions on stragglers. Would you have played 2468 and given up on the consecutive runs? I think the five crack, the five crack was holding them back. Maybe I should have switched to 2468. Let me know in the comment section what you would have done. The other two players were doing pretty well. Two and three away, respectively, I believe. Not bad. If you would have done anything differently for any of those hands, let me know. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click that little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules, may all your picks be keepers.